Tomorrow morning, this conference room will be the center of activity as a very important meeting takes place. Questions will be asked, ideas and solutions will flow, but some of the most important queries will involve how maintenance, repairs, and operations inventory, or MRO, is being handled. Questions like, why do we always seem to be running out of critical supplies? Do we have any idea what we really have down in the supplies room? We started out, we had these three cabinets. There weren't any particular order, design, nothing, stuff was just junk in there. We had limited tooling, we didn't have here what we needed all the time. Why can't we just have items whose inventory has reached a certain level be automatically replenished? We got min-max quantities on each thing. So when we start running low, they automatically replenish us. How can we reduce our vendor base? Well, another thing I used to not like was when we were on the other system, we had salesmen beating on the door all the time. Why don't we have reports that tell us what tools and materials we have on hand, what were used where, and what's on order? What's made it nice about this is when we get big jobs and stuff like that, they send us a service report. It tells us what we've used, how much we've used. But it tells me, but each employee, what they've used for tooling, where it's been used, and it just allows us to control our job. Why are our supplies costs so high? We could track our tooling. The big thing was cost. We were never able to track our tooling costs before. Now we've got it assigned to specific jobs, what we're spending, what the tooling's costing us. Probing questions. But in today's marketplace and economy, they are mission critical. At One Source Supplies, we have a solution that addresses these and other problems you face daily. It's called Automated Inventory Management, or AIM for short. With three simple tools, barcode labels, a handheld PDA type scanner, and a telephone line, your reorder process will be simplified, and your acquisition and possession costs will be reduced dramatically. So how does it work? Let's look at that and examine some of the other benefits you'll see. First, the basics. You just supply your one source supplies representative with a master list of the items that you want to track in the system. These can be consumables, non-consumables, chemicals, or materials you use in your manufacturing process, even office supplies. Virtually anything that you can inventory and replenish can be put into the system for analysis. Each item is given a barcode with a unique identifier. Your one source supplies representative will affix the barcode labels at the appropriate location during implementation. You decide the maximum number of each of these items you need to keep on hand to keep your production going. Then you decide at what quantity you want to reorder those items. Setting the minimum maximum quantity allows you to accurately plan your inventory. Now when an item is needed out on the shop floor, the employee goes to the tool distribution area and scans his or her ID badge, the LHR sheet which indicates what job they're working on, and then the item and the quantity they need. They're done and back on the floor in less than a minute. In all reality, if a guy comes back in here, he can be in and out in a minute. At the end of the day or shift, the scanner is placed in its modem cradle and the operator presses the sync button. A connection is established with the one source supply server and all of the day's issues, receipts, and adjustments are uploaded to it. Any items whose quantity has reached the minimum or below is automatically reordered and scheduled for delivery. A daily replenishment report is a symbol created in an audit trail of what items were ordered at any time. Of course, this report can be reviewed for your approval by downloading it from the One Source Supplies website. That sounds simple enough, but what other benefits are there to using AIM? Well, let's see. How about increased inventory returns? You can imagine a guy sitting back there ordering finger tape, ordering dressers, protective sleeves, and discs. You know, it's all day project on just one cabinet. With the AIM system tracking the usage and need to replenish of all items, you don't have to labor over making large, complicated tool orders that ties up capital and consumes an excessive amount of time. Inventory is ordered on a just-in-time basis, which requires less space and reduces inventory carrying costs. Speed in ordering. It takes only a few seconds to have your employees scan their ID badge, scan the job sheet, and scan the item and quantity they are removing from inventory. And when the scanner is set to sync with the one source supply server, the data is transferred and it's done in seconds. Ease of use. The AIM scanner is simple to use. Anyone can be trained to use it in 15 minutes or less. And teaching them to use the scanner is simple. It don't take them but a minute to. Better manage inventory. AIM puts you in the driver's seat by allowing you to see exactly what items you have on hand anytime you need to. What made it nice when IMC comes in, first off they organized it so we could find stuff. They assign the M numbers, you can see on here, 
and stuff. And I mean, it's pretty well organized. And what it what it made possible was we knew what we had. What they do is help manage the inventory with us, so we can find out basically where our spikes are and what's going on with those. We do uh, cost savings with them, and uh, we find out exactly where our inventory is going, and we manage it that way. Use the comprehensive reports to track inventory by up to six flexible fields, such as employee ID, job number, machine number, department number, etc. This can also allow you to watch for shrinkage or hands in the bin. You can even plot usage across multiple installations or supply rooms. Detail usage report. Online reports means instant information anytime. The reports help you better manage inventory, reduce obsolescence, reduce hoarding, and eliminate maverick spending. We'll discuss them in more detail momentarily and even show you some. Significantly reduce paperwork. Paperwork is virtually eliminated while still creating a defined audit trail. Plus, paper releases are no longer needed. The scanned issue data is the pull signal to make a release at minimum or below. AIM also scans receipts, eliminating or reducing the need for receiving documentation. Finally, summary billing reduces costs, meaning no more multiple invoice payments. What I really like about it, there's, there's no lag on the data. No accounts payable, when it was received, it was when it was actually used. Lower order processing cost. AIM will significantly reduce your internal ordering processing cost. Only items that are in short supply are ordered and only in the quantities needed to bring them back up to the maximum level. The more items you add to the system, the lower your overall operating cost. Earlier I mentioned usage reports. These are a key element to the process. Usage reports are generated in detail to include all of the fields captured by the scanner in the issuing process. These fields can include, but are not limited to, item number, description, quantity issued, department, cell, finished goods part number, machine number, and employee ID. Reports are available online at the One Source Supplies website. They can be downloaded and are in Microsoft Excel format, allowing easy sorting for management analysis purposes. Uh, really easy. All you do is extract the data, put it in the Excel spreadsheet, and sort it. You can utilize it with pivot tables or anything in Excel that you'd like to do to manage the vital few and trivial many. I really like the spreadsheets. Let's take a look at some of them now. As a OneSource Supply customer, you can create your own user ID and password to the OneSource Supplies customer login area on their website. This will give you access to all the reports available. The first one we'll check out is the replenishment report. This report shows all the items that have reached minimum or below on any given day and need to be ordered and delivered. It can also be sorted by any of the columns shown to allow you to view it as needed. Next comes the Item Master Report. This is the list of the items you want tracked by the AIM system. It also shows the minimum maximum levels that are set that will let the system know the maximum number of each item you want to keep on hand and at what level you want to reorder them. The Usage Reports comes next and these are available in three date ranges previous 40 days, one week, and previous day. This report gives an accounting of each of the items that were issued out of the system over the period chosen. This report allows you to sort the records by any field that is captured during the scanning process. If vending is a requirement, let us tell you about the OneSource Supplies Vending Cabinet System. By now you can see that the OneSource Supplies AIM program is the MRO inventory service you need to take control of inventory management costs. All you need to do now is let your One Source Supplies representative know that you would like to get started right away or that you would like to have an assessment done of your current supplies inventory management. This assessment will point out the key areas of cost savings opportunity and the recommended next steps in getting you set up with the AIM system. One Source Supplies brings a lot of input and uh, cost savings. They bring information to me so I can make decisions. It went from order and complete chaos because people were hoarding tools. We've cut down on our downtime a lot. I'd say we probably cut out eight or ten different vendors we were having to deal with. I mean, choo choo, you're done. Choo, you're out of here. It's nice because you don't ever have to worry about whether it's here or not. But it's awesome. Give us a call and we'll be glad to set up a time to discuss your needs and our commitment.